and welcome to Berwick Mitsubishi. I'm Mark and I'm going to take you for a walk around our little 2013 Mitsubishi Mirage ES hatchback today. Um, as you can see, finished in mulberry or pink or purple, whatever you'd like to call it. Um, a few little stone chips on our bonnet here. It was a country car, so they have been touched up, but just like to highlight that so you can see. Um, as we come around to the driver's side of the car, it's really nice for the way they had color-coded outer mirrors and door handles. And the driver's side presents really, really well. Factory alloy wheels with really good tread on our tires. Um, also important to note, there's not a scratch on the alloy wheels as well. Um, dark tinted windows gives it that really attractive look as well. And really, I, I haven't been able to see a mark coming down the driver's side of the car. Um, as we move around to the rear, fairly consistent with the way it presents. We've got our little tailgate spoiler with our brake light in the spoiler itself. Um, our bumper bar presents really well, can't really see any scratches or anything there, or on the tailgate for that matter, so I'm extremely happy with the presentation there. Um, and the same can be said as we come around to the passenger side of the car. Uh, once again, can't really detect any scratches, dints or marks. Um, and also important to note that our alloy wheels on our left hand side of the car are also unmarked. So overall, apart from a few little touch ups on our bonnet at the front of the car, a really impressive exterior presentation. So back around at the front of the car now and the, uh, the one important thing to take note of is that when Mitsubishi designed the little Mirage it was all about fuel economy. So powered by a 1.2 litre three cylinder motor, it's going to give you 57 kilowatts of power and 100 newton metres of torque. So still a zippy little car around town. But the stunning thing about this car, 4.6 litres combined per 100 k's. So even though it's a really small fuel tank, 35 litre fuel tank, still going to get you over 760 kilometres around town and on the highway. So back around at the rear of the car now, for such a compact small little hatchback, um, still quite a good storage area in the back here. Um, plenty of depth um, just to put all of our cargo and everything. In the event we need additional storage, we can certainly just release these seats and drop them down just to create more cargo area. Underneath our cover here, you can see we've got our Space Saver spare wheel. It's never been on the car, it's brand new. So here we are inside the little Mirage now and it does present like new still. On our driver's armrest, all of our power window switches directly up in front of that, our controls for our exterior mirrors um, and a stability control button to the left there as well. Moving to the steering wheel, which is leather wrapped, um, it is height adjustable so we can set ourselves up where we're nice and comfortable. I like to be able to just see all the uh, indicators on the dashboard. On our left hand side of our uh, steering wheel, all of our controls for our audio and directly below that our Bluetooth buttons as well. Does also support music streaming through your phone, this particular car as well, which is good. Moving to our centre section now, um, our display here just gives us the time of day and what channel we're on as far as the audio goes. Um, an auxiliary input just to our right hand side there and then all of our master controls for our stereo. Down below that, all of our controls for our heating and cooling. Uh, being an extremely cold day in Berwick, we've got the heating system running beautifully and it's lovely and toasty inside. A little storage compartment down below that. Our cup holders behind there. And then of course our transmission, powered by a one speed, constantly variable transmission, the Mirage. And behind that, our handbrake and another cup holder for somebody in the rear of the car as well. Um, other important thing to take note of, just scanning around the inside of the car, you look at the way it presents uh, in extremely good order. Uh, it does have six airbags, this car, front side and curtain airbags. So the really important thing to take note of, that for such a small little car, um, to have a five-star ANCAP safety rating gives you all the peace of mind in the world, which is good. Uh, we originally sold this car new, um, was a female owner, and uh, just moving to the servicing of the car. Our servicing has been carried out at, at, at the correct intervals, uh, 15 and 30,000 kilometres. Uh, and then we've just done a current intermediate service on the car as well. So just in summary, really impressive little small car, ideal first car, 
uh, little automatic, 4.6 litres combined per, per 100 k's, stunning fuel economy, five star ANCAP safety rating, balance of new car warranty. So be quick to give us a call on 9907055 and get the opportunity to own a great little car.